Hi there, how's it going? This is Across the Rubicon channel. I've just watched a video and it was sent to me by a good friend of mine. And the video is of some young Maori boys in Manarewa in Auckland. I think it's in Auckland. And one of them got a ticket by a policeman who was standing at a junction, traffic lights, with a brush in his hand looking like he was going to clean people's windows. But he wasn't. He was disguised as a traffic light window cleaner. I don't know what you call them. And he had a little camera on him. And he had a radio on him. And he's an undercover cop. Would you believe that? And he's actually filming people on their phones at this traffic junction. This traffic lights. And it just makes you wonder how far has New Zealand fallen when you get police doing this. It's pathetic. It really is pathetic. But, you know, people stopping and they're using their phones, I know, it's it's not good. But to go to this length, undercover, on traffic lights, what kind of person even does that? And not only that, they had three or four cops sitting in the van, literally 40, 50 feet away, watching him. And this, 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 this Maori boy, and he sounded like he was with his mates, he he was pulled over earlier in the day so he came back came back with his camera and he confronted this cop and he confronted these cops and he stood his ground this young Maori boy very good very good bit of footage fantastic bit of journalism citizen journalism he exposed the police in Auckland for what they are and the police for what they are in New Zealand we're just following orders it really is this is the kind of people the police well, take him now. And these are the kind of police chiefs we got by doing this kind of thing. They can't. In they, listen, these people wouldn't investigate any crime. It's much the same as in the UK. They investigate hate crimes on, you know, the internet. Someone saying something offensive on Facebook or Twitter or something like that. And investigate that and stand that traffic lights, filming people on their phones so they can send them a $150 or whatever fine. It really is pathetic. But that's where we are in New Zealand. That's where we are with Jacinda, the tyrannical worst prime minister in the Western world. Well, probably second only to Justin Trudeau. No, I'll put her first. This is where we are, people. Follow the link below and have a look yourself. Okay, this is Cross the Rubicon. Please subscribe to my channel and share everywhere. And watch the video below. See you later.